Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 17. Boop. Um, so I'm just waiting to go to, um, oh god where am I going today? Cragside with National Trust. Um, should be good and see all the Christmassy stuff they've done with it because I've been there before. Don't really remember but I have been there apparently. Oh Emmy man! Disgusting little pig. So my cat's not quite litter trained yet and yes she's over one. She still hasn't picked it up. And the behaviour therapist at the vet has said, I've tried everything basically that she could suggest. Because I've talked to a few people about it, like from Cats Protection and different vets and things. So she said, I've tried everything she was going to suggest. And that it might be that she's never going to learn to poo in a tray. So basically, she, she does ways in her tray, so she, she knows she's meant to go there. And she does all of the usual stuff, like when she's going on the floor, she'll like scrape on the floor as if she's like trying to cover it with litter and stuff. So she knows what she's meant to do. So there's like, I feel like I'm talking about a human because there's literally no excuse for this behaviour. <laughs> um, she's got a new spot now. And it's like right in the corner of the sitting room behind a scratch post near the Christmas tree. And it's just really hard to get to, sort of. So I've had to like move the scratch post. But then that gives her more room to do it. So then it's like, well, now I wish you're going to think that it's all right to do it. Because I've moved the scratch post to give her more room. But actually I've moved the scratch post so that I can get into it. <laughs> um... It's a bit of a minefield really, like, I just don't know what the right thing to do is and I feel like I've tried everything, like she's had um, different kinds of litter, so she's had like gravel litter, she's had like um, wood pellet -y liver, liver, <laughs> litter, um, she's had different types of trays, of litter trays, so she's had like hooded ones, um, normal ones. She's got two she's got two at the minute, one's hooded and one's not. I've tried them in different places of the room. So she's got one that's in a very private place, like behind the TV, and she's got one that's kind of in the room. Um in case that was the issue. What else have I done? I've had puppy pads down. Um and then tried to like put the puppy pads in the litter tray once she was sort of regularly going on the puppy pads and moved them to the litter tray so that she thought well in the hope that she would think oh well these are in here now so I have to go here but no um I've also gone so far as to because if you don't know she is a rescue cat and she was found wandering the streets and stuff when she was only a few weeks old so um I've even tried putting soil in the litter tray in case she was like used to going on soil um, and it hasn't worked and she's just still doing it so I think the behaviour therapist is right I think that I just need to accept that she's probably not going to learn it now she's over a year over a year old so I don't think there's any hope <laughs> but I did say that at least I've got um, oh, I need to open my tank on this. At least I've got like wooden floors. If I had carpet, it would be very difficult. And um, oh, I've got wooden floors, so it's much easier to clean up. And it also, if it was wee, it would be a lot harder to clean up. And someone I know said. Yeah, I would have given up by now, or I would have took her back. And I'm like, yeah, but, oh, I've got an eyeshadow, but it kind of looks like I could use it as a highlight. And I don't think I'm going to be able to get it out. I need to put my wrist back in its splint. That's for sure. Oh, it is hurting. I don't 
still may not get that out. Someone will have to help. Um, so it's kind of gone a bit hopeless. Also, thank you to people who message to say how many reindeer Santa has from yesterday. Although most of the answers, they weren't quite sure. But thanks for watching the video enough to see that I asked for people to tell me. Thanks. So, I will see you guys at Cragside. Over here, the lake's all frozen over. Look at it. And there's sheep in the distance. This is the tree room, apparently. just had a bit of a drive around the grounds and um, we've looked in the house which I showed you a bit of um, and we've been told that there's some robins and maybe some deer around by the play park so we've drove around the grounds to come up and have a look can't see anything so far um, I'm just sitting in the car because I couldn't be bothered and my wrist's killing and I know I don't need my wrist to walk around but still um, yeah, but it's been nice, so I think we're gonna go and get some dinner soon once we've checked for robins and deers. Um, there wasn't any on the way around, which I thought we were more likely to say on the way around rather than like here, but apparently they're really tame and the robins will like feed out your hands, so um. Okay, um, oh, no, that's not, um, I will show you guys what I eat for dinner. I'm hoping that it's going to be like proper pub dinner or something, you know, like scampi or like sausage and mash or something like that. That'd be nice. Um, so I'll see you guys soon. So I've just had steak and ale pie here for Angla's arms. It's really nice. I'm going home now. Hello. So I'm finally home. Um, I've got half the Christmas tree lights on because I still haven't replaced the other half. Got some TV lights and got some fire lights. 
and uh, my foot stuck. Um, oh God, it was a really good day though. I had a lovely time. Um, nice to be back home with my babes though. And gonna get a blog post done. And um, I need to wrap some presents for oh, one of the besties, Georgie. I'm seeing her on Thursday and I'm doing something like all day tomorrow. So this is kind of my only chance before Thursday to wrap them. So I need to get them done tonight. Um, but I'm gonna do the blog post first and get that up and then I'll do the presents. So probably the next look you'll see will be a time lapse of me wrapping presents. Look at this. <laughs> What are you doing? You silly Billy. Get off. Get off skis. Have a look at the camera. Yeah, that got you, didn't it? She's like, ooh, camera. <laughs> she's trying to get it. <laughs> she's preparing while she's doing all this. Don't know if you can hear her. Oh, hi. So, um, it's a bit later on. <laughs> And I haven't wrapped any presents and I've already just finished one blog post. So that was that productive plan out the window, wasn't it? Um gonna get this vlog up and then I'm gonna go to bed because I have something on all day tomorrow and it's a bit of an early start. Um so I will see you guys in the morning. 